Hey everyone, this is Ryan Mitchell from thetinylife.com. Uh, today, I want to do a little experiment and figure out how much a crock pot uses when you cook a meal in it. Uh, this question came to mind because I'm planning my electrical system for my tiny house and I'm trying to figure out exactly what size of a panel and the amount of power I'll be using and things like that. And I don't usually use a crock pot, but every now and then uh, it is kind of the right tool for the job, uh, especially when you're cooking kind of lower quality meats or roasts or things like that. And it occurred to me that when you use a crock pot, you are leaving it on for a very long time, uh, typically like five, six, seven, eight hours, depending on what you're cooking and it's very convenient but what kind of power usage does it use so uh, i want to do an experiment and i'm going to be using a, a device called a kilowatt basically what you do is you plug the kilowatt into the wall and then whatever you want to measure into it and you can get this off pretty much anywhere online uh, for about 20 to 30 bucks and it's just really useful to help kind of be conscious of your energy energy usage and what it allows you to do is track the the watts the volts and things like that of uh, the item that's you're monitoring and you can actually input the cost per kilowatt from your power company and it'll tell you what that's cook uh, what that cost so today we're cooking uh, ribs barbecue ribs um, using beef short ribs uh, today and uh, what I'm gonna do here is uh, run the crock pot measure it with the kilowatt and then go from there so I'm gonna first uh, right now the crock pot's off and now I'm turning it on to low so you can see it's about hundred and eleven watts and then I'm going to turn it off okay so we went from low to high or excuse me off to low and now we're gonna go from off to high here all right so it looks like it's hovering around 192 watts, which is about 80-ish watts difference between low and high. And I'm going to leave my crock pot on high while I cook these ribs. So for those of you who are wondering how your crock pot at home compares, uh, I'm using a crock pot by Rival that is rated at 120 volts 60 Hertz and 190 watts so you can take those numbers and kind of compare it to your own crock pot at home so here I have just a quick few photos this is the ribs I have my barbecue sauce and then six hours and 54 minutes later all right so we're done with dinner now and I use one and quarter kilowatts to cook my meal here tonight and this is just going to kind of show you some of the costs and the functionality of the kilowatt. It cost me 12 cents to make this. That's my current power rate from the power company, 9.7 cents per kilowatt. That's the amount we used and the time. And now I'm going to show you it extrapolates how much it costs you per day and month. So that's per hour. Then we're going to show by day month or excuse me week then month and then year finally so it took me one and a quarter kilowatts to cook my meal tonight which looks very delicious but I looked it up and one and a quarter kilowatts is roughly the equivalent of burning a pound of coal and 60% of the power generated in the United States is done by coal fired plants and so it kind of begs the question of where we use our power. Thanks for watching, and this is Ryan Mitchell with the TinyLife.com.